Welcome back to the Joker Bowl, brought to you by Brick Flops. Exercise doesn't have to stop when you got Brick Flops. I'm with Shane Vereen and Bart Scott, and we're breaking down each of the impractical Jokers and making our predictions for the upcoming season. Before the break, we revealed that Joe has one opponent that knows how to get under his skin and make him fail the most. Let's find out who it is. Drum roll, please. Oh, be careful, guys. You don't want to tear a ligament. You are a hot woman. You are a hot woman. Trapped in an average woman's body. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> you. Uh, what do you do to work out your ponytail, cupcake? But what? <laughs> right. My grandmother was a great painter. My, my grandmother was a great painter. She taught me three things. About how to draw a tree. How to draw a tree. How to paint a man. How to paint a man. And how to please a woman. <laughs> and how to... <laughs> Ask him if his wife lets him plant a zucchini in her backyard. So is your wife, uh... <laughs> Ask this guy to get up and then smell his seat. Mm -mm. Uh, the name of my blog is, uh... <laughs> Silly Little Short Fellows. <laughs> uh, you seem like uh, the type of gal that, uh... I got married for the baby. Oh, oh my gosh! <laughs> got the bananas on sale. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. When it comes to defeating Joe, Q is the strongest offensive player by telling him to say the most offensive things. He's made Joe fail more times than Sal and Murr have combined. 